there's a question about uh, how to assign a number using the quote shortcut. It's just, uh, well, if you type enter, it just creates it there. If you double click and type something else and then click outside, it just keeps that information. The question is how to change a number in here. For example, if I change the range of rotations, I can say, well, instead of 0 to, to 360, let's only go to, to 45 degrees. You can press Enter here, and it'll assign them without closing the menu. So you can actually play around with that, just pressing Enter. And when you're happy, you can either commit or click outside of it if, you're, if you've already applied it once. Creating sliders directly from here, so double click anywhere to, to open up this window. You can type uh, a minimum, a value, and a maximum using smaller than symbols. So you can say anywhere between 1 and default of 5 and maximum of 25. And th this will create a slider for whole numbers only between 0, or sorry, 1 and 25 with a default of 5. If you want the same, but with a more accurate, uh, with, but with more th 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 decimal places, you can type 1 equals less than 5 equals less than 25.00, for example. It will find the number with the most accuracy and use that as, as an indicator of how many de decimal places to, to include in the slider. I could even type uh, 1. Point Zero, 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 less than 5, less than 25, and actually get lots and lots of decimal places in this slider. Like it's so long that it doesn't even fit on the. Yeah, there we go. If you want to change the slider afterwards, you can always uh, open up and edit it, or double click on the dark gray part to bring up this editor. And you can change the number of decimal places, you can change the limits, you can change the value of it. And you can even switch to even or odd numbers only if you want to. If you click on this part, double click, you can enter a number without having to drag it there. <laughs> 